Yo, <laughs> shut up! Shut up! Are you on the phone or not? No, yeah, I was on the phone doing stuff. What were you doing? Uh, it's too old to be doing that. You're not going to jail for that. Mike sucks ass, so it's amazing to watch him. All right, welcome back to the night shift, ladies and gentlemen. You're working late, so it's time to clock in. Clearly, you guys may or may not know, but I was at one point an athlete in a former life. The house here in Burbank that many of you have come to know as one of the greatest content houses in the history of the internet. From creators like Ricky Banks, Rice Gum, Summer Rae even. It's coming to an end guys, it's over. Absolutely nothing was produced as a result of this house. Uh, obviously us, you know, we're creating constantly, but other than that, god dang what a waste of fucking time. Was it super successful from a content standpoint? No, but it's a beautiful home and we're leaving. It's been brought to my attention that I have a, a gambling debt. I owe Shaban $2,000. Option number one, I give you approximately what I owe you with a slight, yeah, you know, discount. Slime ball. You fucking slime ball. I knew you tried to pull some shit, you fuck. I knew you tried. You know his sister's in the hospital right now? Yeah, she's bad on drug addiction. Yeah, yeah, and you know a lot about that. I think you give a fuck about that. So, uh, approximately the amount of cash, or... <laughs> I want it already. Whatever's in there. I don't get about or the Or get what's in the box. Okay. Past boxes have included trips to Albania, big sums of money, but also completely empty sometimes. Probably a fucking bullshit NFT scam. Don't do it. Take the money. I'll take Squ the box. What am I going to do with two grand? Give us a box. Give us a fucking box. This did not work out as I believe. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a fucking box. Watch your eyes. <laughs> It's the keys to a 2021 Range Rover. Wait, no, 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 but this, yeah. no, but hold on a second, stop, stop, stop. It's done, stop. It's, no, done. Stop. It's, a, it's a rental, yes. so you drive it for three days and you have to put gas back in it to the same level as you got it at before you Let's return. go return the rental car we got, right, fuck it? It's under his name, motherfucker. We're going cross no, country. We're keeping your car. We're keeping your car. No, I thought you were going to take the money. No, no, no. no. Thank you. Hey, your sister's you going to love this car. What are you doing? Stop. stop, this is the worst thing that's ever happened to me. And now a word from our sponsors. All right, do you guys ever feel like traditional banks are a little bit outdated? As you guys know, not too long ago, I was flat broke and the banks just made things worse. If I didn't maintain a balance, I got charged. If I overdrafted, I got charged. If I did anything, I got charged. I had no money and the bank still wanted more. Well, today's video is sponsored by Albert and they're changing all of that. Albert offers a bank account that is free to sign up for and easy to use. This thing swipes just like a debit card, but gives you cash back at your favorite places like McDonald's, Starbucks, and Walmart, and right after you swipe, you'll see that cash back appear in your account immediately. And most importantly, Albert doesn't charge overdraft fees ever. Plus, they'll even spot you up to $250 if you ever get in a tight spot and need cash. And they could even help you get your paycheck up to two days early. And on top of all that, Albert also has a team of financial experts that they call geniuses that are always available when you need help. So yeah, basically, Albert is the future. So click the link in the description box below or go to albert.com slash mailac to download the Albert app today. And for a limited time, when you open a checking account and connect a qualifying direct deposit, you'll get a $150 cash. That's albert.com slash Malak. Go check it out and let's get back to the night shift, baby. Hello? Hey. Hey, sis, what's up? My sister's here. Is it cool if she comes up and grabs something? Yeah, of course. My sister's coming up here, here right now? Yeah. Don't act like a fucking idiot. I have to give her something really quick and then she's no, dipping. No, of course, I'm very respectable. No, 100%. Don't fuck around, it's a sister. I'm not. I, 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 yeah, I promise. Hey, I will, why are you laughing? Be... And you're laughing inside your face. I'm not laughing. Hi. Oh, my God. Hi, girl. Oh, hey. How are you? Good. How are you? Good to see you. Um, uh, can you give these back to mom? She left them in my car last week. This is a okay. porn star? Yeah, what? No, this is a porn star. What are you doing? Oh, no, no. Just... Hi. Hi. This is Emily, my, si Hi. Hi. my sister. Hi. My sister. Nice to meet you. Thank you. That's your sister? Yeah, yeah man. Why is that weird? Very surprised I didn't know it was your sister. Oh. I mean, I wouldn't call it your sister. I just would say more of step. Brother. Yeah, don't be weird, real quick. I'm cool. not. I'm trying. I am. I'm like, cool. Well, I'm why fine. do I understand? Like, have you met someone's sister before? Like, why is this awkward for you? Uh. <laughs> I. S someone's calling me. I need to take a call real quick. I'll be back. Does he barf? Does he always get like that? Um. Yeah. Do you know why he's acting like that? 
He just he doesn't know how to talk to girls. Yo, <laughs> Yo. <laughs> you okay? Hey, guys. You're right? you okay? I think you're on the phone. Yeah, no, I'm good. Are huh? you on the phone or not? No, yeah, I was on the phone doing stuff. What were you doing? I had. Was your cock out? No, 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 no. I was on the phone. I had to call my dad because I had like something really important to do right now. Then what are you doing? He had his cock out. You had your. He Bro, you just met out. my sister and you have your dick out in the bathroom? I was on the phone with my dad. Y'all are so extra right now. He goes, he meets her, he goes in the bathroom, he's got his fucking dick out in the bathroom. Whoa, 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 Steven, you showing You're a sister fucking your pervert. Dick? Steven. Steven, it's his sister. You showing her your dick? You said phone. you're gonna play it cool. You take your dick out in the bathroom in front of his sister that just came to visit her from New York. She came all the way out of here from Long Island, Connecticut. <laughs> Wherever the fuck you're from, it's Stephen. Not, we warned you, Stephen. I'm sorry. You can't do things like this sorry, around I'm here. I'm so sorry. I, 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 I was just charges or something. We're gonna need fucking hot water. I'm really okay. nice. I promise. I will fine. No, I'm glad you did. It's okay. Oh, it's it's so good. I forgive you. For Give her a hug, Stephen. Trying hug. to shoot your load in the toilet. No, I don't do that stuff. I'm we're going for a hug. I don't. I don't trick off. It's okay. I like perverts. How long have you been brothers with Mike? I've been calling him stepbrother for like three or four years. It's he like... likes it when I call him stepbrother. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guten tag, everybody. We are in Columbus, Ohio. We just landed. Columbus has one of the most robust German populations. Obviously, with all the unrest in Europe lately, David's missing home a little bit. He's been talking to his mom every day. And I find out that there's this fucking German district. It does look like Germany. This is serious. The kid's excited about Germany. Got it, got it. Oh, I'm little... actually not that excited. What do you mean you're not that excited? I lived in the US for five years. I went home twice. Tell me how much I miss Germany, bro. <laughs> Jesus Christ. God. Dude, Mike was like, dude, this is gonna be a moment. He's like, what the fuck, bro? This is bullshit. If I wanted to go back home, I would go home. <laughs> For all the German fans watching this, because I know I got them. David, maybe get the Schoko Sch Schoko Schaumküsse. Schoko Schaumküsse. Oh, right. that's my favorite. The white the chocolate one? I'm starting to feel a little funny. Wow! Sprechen Sie Deutsch! I'm a female from the 20s. I don't have lines yet. <laughs> Up. Shake my hand, brother. What's going on? <laughs> I ditched George at the hotel because I have an exclusive on Hungover Logan content. Hungover Logan's the only Logan that vlogs. <laughs> no other Logan wants to be a part of content. <laughs> Fuck your video. What are you doing? Why are you doing that? Uh, just a little moist under my arms. Why is your arm bare? So red. Dude, 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 wait. You, you all know something? I'm an actual ginger. It's not funny. <laughs> it's not, I swear to God, Oliver Tree said it on the podcast. You are. He goes, he. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Look at it. Look at. It. I'll say it right now. Here's an exclusive hungover, Logan. I'm a fucking fire crotch, dude. <laughs> Demo. Every person in the audience right now is gonna be looking at you like this. Yeah. <laughs> ready to shit themselves. So I'm gonna be standing with Bradley Martin. More like Bradley Farting because of all that protein. Wow! So Bradley Martin just rolled up, and there's a competitor that doesn't have an opponent, and they just said Bradley can go against them, and they'll pay him 10 G's. He's a professional. He's a professional. Oh my god. Oh, I don't know, dude. That's a bad idea. Mad Max. I don't think I'm trained for this. There's a dead mouse right here, Columbus, Ohio, the day before the live show. How did you start like that? You're making Ohio seem like a shitty place because the mouse. You didn't have to say that. He's fine. He's taking a nap. He's taking a nap. He's taking a nap. He's fine. He's fine. Columbus, Ohio, beautiful city. Mouses take naps on the sidewalk. It's great. Crazy fucking scene outside this food market. Is this OSU like campus? I couldn't tell you, Mike. Don't know anything. Partying college kids everywhere. People videoing us. Preston's Burgers. They've put together a real presentation for us today. Okay, you're not supposed to be eating the food until the Review starts. Got it, got it, got it. Got it, got it, got it. With both of you. With you, especially, and you're the main fucking dude that does this. What, what are you talking about? Double patty. We got pickles, we got special sauce, and we got onions. Right, Potato bun, nice. super soft. It's soft, it's all soft. The buns are soft. And the double crispy french fries. Dude, they're one phenomenal. That just, by the way, really quick, this kid's an expert. His bite zone is perfect. Look at that. It's strong, I'm not gonna lie. I got all the ingredients. Let me see your bite. Your bite zone's a fucking mess. You're gonna chew with a paper. Well, you guys just came back from a festival and you washed your hands, you fucking pagans. That's festival. What is it, Woodstock? <laughs> what do we take a quick fucking detour to Woodstock? <laughs> First of all, you're right, I'm sorry. Three, two, one, go. Oh, oh fuck. 
The meat is very nicely seasoned. It's not crazy, the quality of the meat. It's not like nuts. Cheese is delicious. The potato bun's super, super soft. The pickles, I'd like a little more thickness. They're not girthy pickles. As everyone knows, women and cheeseburger eaters love girth. You, you better give us a high fucking rating, bro. This is my state. See, that's the problem. This kid has what's called hometown bias. It's a problem. You should be disqualified from this whole rating. Oh. You want to give this thing too high of a score, I'm going to try these crispy fries. Super crispy, super salty. Ugh. Ugh. Hold up, it's clogging my arteries right now. Come on. You yeah. know when you visit your local fair? Of course. You ride the merry go around the Ferris wheel with your family, yeah, yeah. you get tickets, yeah. and then you get the fries. Yeah. That's what these fries taste like. Yeah. Columbus, a city named after the man who discovered this country. Well, that's not true. No, the natives. <laughs> People were here already. Don't, don't go into it. No, don't skip good. that. All right, <laughs> Columbus, Ohio, Preston's Burgers. I'm gonna give it a 7.8. You motherfucker. 7.8. You're a real piece of shit, Mike. I swear to God. No, no, no. He from Ohio too, bro. No, no, no. What did you rate it? Because I told Jeff in there, I was like, there's no way by the looks of this burger, you don't give it an 8.5. That's what did you end up? I would have said too, it's bro. It's not just a look thing. How about the looks, it's dude? Not a look thing. Like 7.8 is a very respectable fucking score. It's it's that's dude. 78%, brother. That's a C plus. Mike sucks, Mike sucks. <laughs> Somebody wake up that fucking mouse. <laughs> all right, well, yo, it's been a great episode here on the night shift, Los Angeles, Columbus, and all the way to our first ever live impulsive show. You're not supposed to be one of them, David. You can't shake me. You can't make me sweat because I'm getting better each and every day because I got a great audience at home watching this episode and the one after it and the one before it. But that's it for this one. Thank you so much for working late with us. We're clocking out. Peace. I know you've been a good friend, but so is David Dobrik. Get out. I gotta stay Hey, neutral. he's an on. Yo, he's an on. face, motherfucker. Get the fuck out of my house. What did you say? I swear to God, I'm not even fucking around. All right. Because you need to get the fuck out of you. Stephen, get him out. That's what he said. He's saying his boys with David, bro. No, I didn't say that. Yeah, Mike, you gotta go. David's been good to me, too. What? Because David has followers? Get the fuck out. David never threw a dirty needle at me. You fucking needle. Get the fuck out of here. Everybody knows you're not qualified to handle that rifle. It's a toy, Mike. I'll beat you up with it. But the problem is, is I always try to figure it out, is like, you have to do it a certain way, because if I do it this way, then I'm drinking a mirror. <laughs> Bro, are you, are nah, you showing my dick on the vlog? <laughs> <laughs>